Hey guys, I'm here at RTI factory and we are here to reveal you the secrets behind uh, RTI's long range barrel. In the past, airgun barrels were designed for relatively low velocities and for relatively short ranges. And nowadays, this trend is changing. Everyone wants to shoot at a higher velocity. PCPs are getting more and more powerful, have better efficiency. And everyone also wants to shoot at, at longer ranges. And it turns out that the regular barrels that are from that era are not really that good at this task. And that's mainly because of the twist rate. So uh, I joined up with RTI and we decided to develop together a barrel that is dedicated for shooting pellets at high velocity at long ranges. Uh, I have here uh, Robert from RTI. Hi. Hi. Uh, he will give you a little bit more details on the barrel and then we will sum up the specification. Please. Okay, so uh, the barrel is ma manufactured but, uh, by uh, Lothar Walter according to our specifications. And then uh, it, it is machined uh, by our sub subcontractors. So uh, the length of, of the, we have two lengths of, of the barrels uh, uh, that is uh, 51 centimeters or approximately 20 inches or 60. Uh, centimeters which is almost uh, 24 inches. Uh, the barrel has a twist rate of uh, one turn per 32 inches. So this is the key here. This the is slow the twist rate. One turn per two inches. Yes. Yes. And uh, uh, the the barrel is choked. So uh, at the end there is a choke of uh, two ten, uh, two hundredths of a, a millimeter. Uh, the barrel has also a little bit bigger on the oval uh, uh, transfer port. Uh, and these are basically the, the main yeah. characteristics of this uh, uh, long range barrel. Okay, so to sum up, polygonal Lothar Walter barrel with one in 32 inch twist. Choke is uh, one, uh, two hundredths of a millimeter. This is actually half of the traditional choke. And the reason for this is because pellets are getting bigger and bigger. They used to be 5.52 millimeters uh, in head diameter. And now they are about 5.57. And there is no need for that extreme choke. And uh, the difference in lengths are because uh, one is designed to be used in... Uh, Profit, the longer one, so the new Profit, which I will have a video about when it comes out. And the shorter is for Priest to be fully interchangeable with the exist existing barrel. So these are the specs. So the uh, transfer port is slightly bigger and oval size. That is because we want to get as much velocity out of this barrel as possible because it's designed for high velocity. Uh, there is also a marking on the barrel. It's 5.5 are as in long range. There were actually two of us that uh, were competing with uh, my gun, so my profit with long range barrel at the EBR, uh, simply because Francisco shipped his gun a little late and uh, it didn't arrive in time. And in the end, uh, he ended up winning the 50 yards uh, bench rest. And this was despite the fact that it was the most uh, uh, windy relay. He had the most windy relay. So this really proves how important it is for the pellet to reach the target as soon as possible. So the high velocity here really helped. And of course, other manufacturers and other competitors usually don't dare to go with that high velocity because they know that uh, it is a uh, possibility that the pellet will be unstable. And uh, for me, uh, actually, the, the first uh, 75 yards, I didn't shoot so well because it was my first competition and I didn't have tactics sorted out and things like that. But on the second take, I actually had the highest score. By the way, I have a video of, uh, of our whole adventures at EBR uh, 2019. So make sure you check the link below and you can uh, watch the whole, the whole thing. So Robert, do you have any information regarding when those barrels will be available? Yeah, I believe that they will be available on, 
uh, in the second quarter of the 2020. Perfect. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe and hit that bell to get uh, information about new videos I release.